Good evening, everyone. Hope you're having a very fun Monday. Uh, we'll be kicking off in just a moment, as normal. Just uh, getting ourselves settled, making sure that things are coming through correctly, as is so often the case. Yes. Uh, right, would you like to start with the scam run? Yeah, I think that's uh, always a smart and sensible plan. Just before we do, though, I was curious, how's your Euro level doing? Uh, 200,000 and 78. Oh, you, wow, you've, uh, yeah, you've nailed that. I'm at 11.85 mil rubles. Holy moly. And I, to be honest, I'm getting so much money at this stage that I've sort of stopped paying attention to it, which is nice. But. So in, in the last week, I've managed to get 148,000 euros. So I don't feel like I'm doing badly in yeah, that that's, that's doing pretty well the the trade-off that we have between us is i prioritize euros and you prioritize getting a third thick case yes which i have not so like it's i would say it's probably comparable oh uh, yeah I, I reckon so that's uh that's easily 11 and a bit mil okay where would you like to scab run uh let me have a look and check my quests. Right, so fence, eliminate PMCs. Right, I don't care where we go. Uh, maybe streets? Yeah, streets sounds good. Mine wants me to go to factory uh, through gate three twice, and I'm like, I'm not sure I care. <laughs> I, so I, uh, I've tweaked my settings ever so slightly, um, and okay. in solo, I've been getting better performance on streets. Not good performance, but at least a bit more um, consistent performance. So I'm curious as to how it does with um, uh, with OBS running. Yeah, I mean, streets is never great for me. It's actually worse since the last patch. I've not tried it since the most recent. recent Which was lunchtime today. Over the weekend, I basically had dead raids again. Uh, still waiting for my last three um, Punisher kills, uh, sadly. Uh, winged another couple of people, very, very far in the distance. Not enough to make uh, a kill. I'm, I'm not surprised. I'm not the only one that was having the uh, loading in issues. Um, my personal testing showed that as soon as you load the, ha uh, the hideout, you have to close the game and reopen the game in order to actually get into a raid. I did not have that experience at all throughout any of this. Yeah. And I've been like going into the hideout in between. Oh, yeah, yeah. There, like, there'll there'll like, be something hideout, specific. Run, hideout, PMC run. Um, I did see one of the, the devs in response to one of the threads on X saying, don't use your hideouts, folks. Said, it's not that. It's related, but it's not that. Right. So. Who knows? Maybe it's the Intel Center or something breaks it. And yeah. Or if you if you've got uh, a level thirty seven bear tag in your in your thing, then you can't get in. It's probably something like one of your guns in your gun rack is <coughs> <laughs> like using the uh, uh, gorilla aggressive uh, flashlight mount thing. And that being pre cached in memory breaks loading into raids. Some, some yeah. preposterous like that. Hey there, Kevin. Welcome along. Uh, either way, I'm really glad that they fixed it because I was not looking forward to having to close the game in between every single time I go into the hideout. Well, you say they fixed it. See, I haven't seen it either way. Yeah. So as far as I'm concerned, they might have broken it. In, yeah, in my experience since lunch, I have been able to get into a raid after having gone into the hideout. So... That is that is a success for me. Nice. So depending on where we start in the streets, there's one place that I want to show you that I've mentioned in the past, and it's the real estate office. Okay. Oh, I'm, I'm game for that. And it's down near the um, theatre. Just at synchronising 97%. Yeah, same. Yeah, so because of the loading in problem, I have not played since last week beyond a couple of scav runs. I did one PMC run, and it was the scariest thing ever, 
knowing that my PMC was in raid and that I was having to completely reload to get back in. Uh, yes, I bet. I got Even in. I got in. I heard other PMCs near me. I was able to hide. Um, and then I killed a rogue and then I just left. And I was like, that, that's good enough for me. Oh, wow. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, hello. Speaker of perfect. Mark 16, thanks. Oh, and I've got a red flare as well. Grenades? Did you take his rig? Uh, no, but I took his backpack. Uh, did he have a... Oh, Whoa. shit, get the shot. Woo! I'm inside. Me too. I am going to die, by the way. I reckon I probably will as well. Can all oh, right? I've got a heavy bleed. I've got a slower. Do you need a slower? There's a slower on the floor. Thanks. My stomach is gone. That's the main thing. But appreciate that. I'm still bleeding, by the way. So oh, uh, oh so no, I, I've got no. I've got I've got I've got bandage. Okay. Right. Is there a back way out of this? Sort of. In that, not really. Oh, there. Let's go this way. They got me. I got him. <laughs> well done. God, contact fours. He was lying down waiting for you, basically. No, no. He came through. I started shooting him. Then he lay down after that. God, he was 59. I hit him seven times. I did 94 damage. 310 absorbed by armour. Okay, I'm going to try and quickly try and find a way out. Yeah, yeah, you do that. He's done 1,000... He so many grenades and stuff. Yeah, he's done 1,757 raids. Of which 1,200 are on his PMC. Jeez. This is, a, this is a proper player. He's had his account for as long as we have. So 8,900 hours. <laughs> I'm trying to think where I can go. Uh, uh, ventilation sewer shaft? Sewer manhole. Hmm, no. Ventilation shaft at the... Uh, nope. Uh, how about the exfil at the mall north? No, can't do that either. Basement descent, Kamachase arch, cardinal apartments. I don't know any and... of them. I've always had it so I can do either the ventilation shaft or the the mall. I think sewer is your next best bet, which is over at Concordia. Yeah, so I'm sort of approaching. Uh, yeah, I'm approaching Pinewood at the moment. Do you want me to pull up a map for you? Yes, please. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right, Cardinal Apartment. That's one of them, is it? Yes. Okay, uh, so from Pinewood, if you go to the mall and turn left, cross over the road. So, okay, uh, in fact... So I'm crossing over towards the mall. Okay, so yeah, if you turn left and cross over the next road, that puts you right. uh, basically on the, uh, the top left corner, or uh, sorry, the northwest corner, of that crossroads. Yep. You need to go north a little bit. There will be an archway through to the left. Okay. Once you get into that, that will open up into like a clearing. And the, uh, the exit from that is a bit to the right. So you'll be okay. heading kind of like north in that section. I will keep you posted as soon as I get to the arch. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna paste the image to you. No, 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 because I can't switch to it. Okay. I'm sort of keeping myself alive. 
I'm, I'm running up that North High Street at the moment. Okay. The archway, is it one third, halfway, or two thirds of the way it's up? It's two thirds of the way up. Okay. So actually, yeah, you're, you're heading on your way towards the northern pharmacy that you showed me. Yep, 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 yep. I'm going through the arch now. Okay. So there'll be like a curved road that leads yep. west and hopefully down and then north. Staying down? I assume staying down. So basically, I double back on myself a little, but turning right, yes? Yeah. Okay. okay. And I'm... I'm now at a playground, yeah. uh, which okay. is a courtyard next to that thing. Uh, okay, so the, the playground looks like it's the northeast corner of that that's heading towards the pharmacy. You want to follow that road, and I guess it might lead into an underground parking complex. So this is the Cardinal. Yeah. Do you know where in the Cardinal it is? Uh, it's in the road on the outside. In the road on the outside. Okay. Let's see if there's a way through from inside. No. Okay. So heading back outside then. So the, the playground looks like it's surrounded by roads, assuming that is the playground I'm looking at. Okay, right. I found a way past the Cardinal, so now I'm round the back, sort of. Oh, you might be too far north, north. Uh, I'm going to... Right, I've just sent you the map on Discord. Oh, wow, okay. No, wrong wrong side entirely. So, yep. Came back to the playground. Alright, I'm starting to get the uh, energy... Yeah. Energy dips. That's alright, I've got that to lower from you. <laughs> yeah, because I came down the slopey road, which is the right-hand one of those slopey roads. And the left-hand one was, like, uh, underneath me as a footway. Ah, uh, okay. It's Yeah, it's impossible to tell from... Killing myself at rapid time. Yes, I am at the Xville, healing myself. Awesome. Five, four, <laughs> two, one, zero. Cool, I made it out. I'm not dramatic, you're dramatic. <laughs> well, that was that was fun and stupid. I gotta say, that guy picked a fight with the wrong scabs. Uh, <laughs> having, I, having just had me loot a Mark 16 off that other guy, that's the only reason that we won. I say we won. That <laughs> yes, yes, we run won that. Level 59 bear. Nice. Cool. Uh, cool. So that can go in a graze grenade thing. That can go in a dog pack thing. That theory. That can go on your wall. <laughs> In theory, yes. So I got an AK 5.5 from him. I got a Mark 16 from a random person in the street. I got his contact force, his Defender 2 armor, which by the way is part 5. Nice. Um, I've got his Atomic Defense Ballistic Mask, another spare with me, uh, red flare that I had on me anyway, and then a bunch of other miscellaneous ammo and lambda ammo. So I feel pretty pleased about that overall. Let's see if I can pick all in the stuff. Oh, more grenades. God, he brought so many grenades. Oh, yeah. He might be doing grenadier, but... Or no, going after bosses. Of, it's kind of standard once you reach a I don't care about money point. Yeah. To just... Like 20k is the cost of going into a map almost. Yeah. Case can get that. Oh, wait, no, I don't want that in the Sims case because it's rubbish. Um, fold that. I, I can't fold that. Can I fit this? Is the now interesting question. 
uh, some of this, yes, I can move up here. Uh, Diablo 4 is now slated for release May 14 with quite a change in loot drops and how classes play. Uh, yeah, I heard something about the upcoming changes. I haven't looked to see if it's an expansion or if it's just another season. Um, but a total revamp of uh, loot concepts entirely. Yeah. Basically, it's enough changes that it's a different game. They're, yeah, from what I understand, they're trying to add a lot of the flexibility that you had in Diablo 3 back into Diablo 4, like being able to extract the unique as aspects and uh, and things like that to give people a bit more fine fine control over their builds, which I think is a good thing. More choice is always good. Um, we're probably not going to go back to it anytime soon. We've got uh, Grim Dawn on the horizon for stuff that we're going to dive back into for fighting fantasy stuff. Um, oh, yeah. Which should be good fun. Okay, I'm out and at the menu. I've got some logistics to do, but in the meantime, That's all right. free to think about what you would like us to be doing. I'm going to gear up for peacekeeping. Okay. And I think we should carry on where we left off, peacekeeping on uh, customs. Sounds good. I don't actually need to do anything there, so I'm not sure how I will gear up. I oh yeah, I mean, I do you still need to mark stuff in the marked room? I do, yes. That's very true. Uh, I feel like I should bring a backpack. This should be the backpack I bring. I'm assessing his guns and things for stuff that I want to steal from them. Yeah, of course. The oh, wow. Ergo, ergo grip that I almost missed there. Oh, did I tell you I have a kitted spear? Uh, I think you did mention. It's very pretty. Oh, I, I tidied all my guns up so now they're not selectable by the thing. Right. Uh, let's put... No, that's the wrong AGS grip. There's the AGS grip, right. Ooh, interesting. You can't wear the CQCM and an LSHZ anymore. You used to be able to. Mm, so change that, that in this patch. Yeah, that seems like sneaky balance. Oh, uh, I've also got an M32A1 um, 40 mil cylinder. I don't have the grenade launcher, but I have a spare mag, effectively. <laughs> no. Uh, right, I need... Where's my P mag? There's my P mag. It's not the P... In fact, I wasn't using a P mag before. I was probably using that 60 round mag because that's got bullets in. And that 30 round mag, because that's got bullets in. This doesn't have a bullet in, so... Why did he have so much M80 when he wasn't using anything that uses M80? He might have swapped guns. He might have done. I'm actually just selling the M80 because I don't have space for it. What are you... You've got sauced in, that's fine. Uh... LPS, let's take you out. And we're going to take 856A1 as the spare. All right, I need to swap over my keys. So we're going to go Dorm's keys. Yes, I will need to swap over my keys as well at some point. Okay, so Sordens can sell. Do I want to keep that CQCM mask? Maybe I maybe I miss one of the two that I've got and keep this one. Yeah, maybe. Feels, feels sensible. Let's do that. And then repair this up a little to make people want it more. Filter by item. Yeah, currently going for 377 cut. Alright, so... Peacekeeping mission. Uh, we've been working through doing this 
Uh, I've got three kills on customs, Grace got all 12. We've still got customs and interchange to do from before, and in the most recent patch they've enabled ground zero for people above level 20, so we're going to have to go there and do it. Just when you think you're getting close to finishing a task, they change the tasks, which is totally fine. So I think our, our plan for today is to do customs, then move on to interchange where we can start using up those gas masks that I've been saving. Sorry, respirators, I, not gas masks. I think I'm going to bring out this guy's uh, armor and rig. Why like not? That's, that's sensible. Seeing uh, as you just got it for free. Basically, yes. Uh, so that's okay, that's okay. I'll keep that as well. Uh, do I actually care about L1? I don't think so. It's a 120 second painkiller, so I suppose I... How much How much could I sell it for? 22k. Fine, I'll use it as a painkiller. Why not? Um, don't want this grizzly out with me. Uh, let's... Let's swap it for one that I have mostly used and bring out a mostly used one. No, let, let's not. That's stupid. Let's just put this one in a thing. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. That's good. Um, that's energy. Come out. Five and six, and then I need to pick a gun. Do I bring my SVDS? Mm. I, I'm a little sensitive, so I'll just bring my SVDS. Well, why not? I would. That seems like a really smart thing to do on the off chance of getting PvP. Yeah. You could even bring the red flare and launch it off early to try and draw attention. I've got so many red flares. I could. Um, that, it does feel like a mistake, though. I, I'll bring my toxicase. Uh, I don't need my parrot cord. Let's bring a CMS kit this time. Okay, that's all fine. I think I'm just about ready to go. Just having uh, stress worries about what I'm geared at. Alternatively, you could bring nothing. That seems stupid. And I could get you some guns after defending you from being tagged and cursed. <laughs> right, I'm just going to try my SVDS. Because it has been a little yeah. while since I was doing this. No worries. Uh, so this is going to be very different to last week because the special event with lighting the bonfires has finished. So scavs are back to being their normal scabby cells. Now there was something that I was thinking about doing with this. Uh... Do, do I want to? So what I was thinking uh, is I can bring... Uh, yes, I will do it. Uh, where's my thing? It's going to take me a little while to set up right at the start of the raid and it will probably be for naught as I inevitably die. Oh, no problem. Um, bringing a, a laser and a... Uh, and an SPL laser. And also a... Um, uh, was it WMX 100, which is a infrared flashlight and regular flashlight okay. device. So I can have it on flashlight mode. Mm -hmm. Or laser mode, infrared laser mode. And nothing mode as is kind of my three options. So I can have point fire all the time by having it on infrared flashlight. Mm -hmm. Or I can uh, I just need to like turn on the thing and then yeah. toggle over to... Yeah, start removing, putting things back in and... Uh... Yes. So let me let me just get another cast two inch so hey. on the other side of my gun. Make sure it's on the right, correct side. You carry on. That one is there. So that would be that side. This one would be there. Cool. That's what I've got left and right. Let's go for flashlight on this side. We'll see where it ends up. And then we're going to the height. So what have we got on the side? Okay, both are off. That's fine. So what I can do is try to bring the TBL not attached. I will get into the raid. I will turn on my flashlight, toggle my flashlight, turn it off, attach the laser. No. Leave it on. Attach the laser. Toggle it. No. Yes. <laughs> so we we can find a corner on. while you do all this if you want. I, I need to... Uh, so. I should be able to practice it here, actually. Uh, so, turn on, toggle, and then... I don't think you can tab. then tab and... Yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah. think it stops you. So, 
I need to go turn on toggle, attach laser, and then every time I press toggle, it turns on the laser and off the infrared flashlight and vice versa. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, sure, I'm good to go. PMC, customs, uh, three in the afternoon, therapists. So I need nine scav kills and then done with peacekeeping mission. Uh, if it's convenient, we take you to the dorms and get that marked. Yeah. Bring in the big backpack. Uh, it's I've not died with this backpack yet. I know I'm totally jinxing it, but I thought I thought you had died. It just keeps coming back. Uh. Or maybe I died once with this backpack. I might have died once with this backpack. Man, I didn't even get to shoot the thing on streets that I wanted to because we started getting lit up by... Within the first 15 seconds, like, oh, this is great! That's where we want to go! Do, 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 do. I was out of there like a whippet with a bum full of dynamite. I was like, I'm inside! And then I saw you come running in when I'm already halfway up the stairs. I'm so glad I took that guy's um, backpack. Because he had the yep. slower in it. Ah, oh, right. Yeah, I ended up with a heavy bleed and a light bleed, but I luckily had the ES mark and a regular bandage, so I didn't really need healing as such. Yes, I had uh, just a heavy bleed and a light bleed uh, bandages, but no actual health restoring. Yeah. So when I was shot in the stomach, I was like, well, I've got four and a half minutes to get out of this raid then, and that's it. Fortunately, the slower you gave me uh, got me six minutes, which is all I needed. Oh, I meant to say I, uh, I re-recorded the, uh, the extraction call. Um, oh, yes. It's, it's good now. <laughs> I mean, it was oh, it was it was good before, but uh, like I recreated the uh, the ambient noise and uh, re-pieced it together with the the new audio bits. Nice. You'll have to send that to me later. Right. Since we'll be waiting for players, I was also thinking I'll probably record just off my own back uh, some general musings mm. in, in his diary style. That's like. I never really considered I'd be one for classical music, but evidently, like, Osiris is trying to keep me safe. Uh, and I do find it very soothing. Like, uh, the, <laughs> the mathematical uh, uh, yeah, basically, like, <laughs> analysis of the, the note changes. <laughs> and, and also, maybe, I'm going to see if I can uh, pull in a favour, I will get someone uh, else to uh, record with me. Like, this is possibly for the future. Mm. Um, some dialogue uh, as a back and forth conversation about someone noticing that his tastes have changed. Ah, hmm. that's cool. Like something along the lines of like, why why are you always playing music around the office now? And like that's kind of the trigger point for him going. Hmm, yeah. I hadn't actually noticed, but now that I consider it, like it makes a lot of sense. Yeah, I never realised you were so into theatre before. I guess yeah. I, I didn't really used to be into it. Hmm. And like that could easily lead into like digests, um, not perhaps audio logs, but text ones. Yeah. About what is safety? Right? Is keeping people busy keeping them safe? Yeah. Like that sort of observation. <laughs> Okay. Let me know when you're happy to move on. Okay. 
guy. Okay. Uh, I don't know if it's on or off, unfortunately. No, it's probably off at the moment. I, I think we we go into the parking lot. Sure, it's fine. We can always hide in a garage in there. Yeah, I should do this with night vision really on to know for certain. If you want to hop up on the roof and try and snipe a person going into the... Uh... Going into the office. You think they are? Well, the, the shooting was somewhere relatively close. Sure, I will hop up. And I'm going to look for scavs in the parking lot area. Oh, I can't see anything through that office at the moment. Was that you running? Yes, it was. Okay. Okay, I can see the door. I'm going to go check one of the jackets. Nothing interesting. Right, drinking my drink. Oh yeah, drinking my drink. Nice, I can hear you moving around. I'm gonna. Reposition. I'm not going to stay here forever, obviously. No. Right. I'm going to come back over to you. In fact, I'm going to go um, check for meds in the med car. Love the ambient sounds. Just an AI too. Yeah, still no one there. Tell me when you're bored and you want to move on. I think we could uh, we could probably move on. I'm thinking if we head over to the right hand side past the uh, uh, the train divot, we might be able to look across at RUAF. How does that sound? Weapons free despite me needing scav kills.
Yeah, I'm gonna get myself up into the train car. Yeah, you can hear the ambience now. Right, that's zero to two hundred. Sorry, I know this is not super interesting, but... Hey, it's all good. Right, don't forget, I need player kills, so... Yeah. I'm happy to take it slow. I'm hoping for scavs to appear in the uh, central area as well. Yeah, I've got a good scope. I'll see if I see any. Sorry, that was me. That's all right. For me, that welcome to Tarkov is 125 metres, by the way. Okay, let's dial it down to 150 then. You are quite visible there, just... Oh, I know, that's why I'm being careful, moving back and forth. How are we doing for time? 30 minutes. Drinking my other drink. Yeah, I'm going to do the same. scav spawning over there no so i'm thinking there must be players nearby enough 
what we could do is we could head over to the bridge and go down and up the other side. Well, it's up to you. I think there's likely to be just people coming through this way shortly. Yeah, let's uh, let's give it a few more minutes. Twenty seven minutes. We could wait until like twenty two before moving on. Sure. Twenty six minutes. Drinking my third drink. I have juice as well if you need. I'm at 88.92, I'm okay. Don't even see Sniper Scav on top of one of the, the piles in the distance. No, I think he went down already. Twenty five minutes. So another three minutes, and uh, we can be on the move. And yeah, if we go over the other side, we can uh, go into dorms late effectively and try and get you that marking.
So ZB013 has been powered on. Not entirely surprised with the combat that we've heard. Twenty-three minutes, so one minute more. And I think what we'll do is we'll go along this side, and then we'll go down at the bridge on this side of the bridge. Okay. And then we can always like cross underneath and go up. At the shotgun hut. Okay, going to re-zero for 50 meters. That short distance, I didn't change my zeroing. Bridge. Yeah. Did you hear that? What? 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 what, what? I heard some dogs. Okay, you get different ambient noise to me then. It might have been like a bullfrog or something. Contact over on the left, crossing over the bridge. I'm going to throw a grenade. Gonna throw another grenade. Gonna throw another grenade. I ran all the way to half the port. Gonna throw another grenade. Okay, now I'm out of grenades. I think he's underneath me. I am at the little hut on the bridge. Okay. I'm going under the bridge. Okay. From his side. It's a shotgun scav and unfortunately he got me. I can't believe he got, I got him. those shots. I got him. I see your body. I'm gonna save your stuff. I can't believe that. I put so much stuff into him. Yeah, 310 damage. That's annoying. I'm Seven literally bringing all of your stuff head. with me. That's hilarious. Right, where am I going?
Okay, I might be able to get out at dorms. Good luck. I'm a little bit heavy with your stuff, but... Understandable. Oh man, that just shows me how trash I am sometimes. You know what, this is probably worth an SJ6. I did not bring money for Dorm's Extract, so I'm going to be going all the way around. Oh, the BO13 has been powered up. It's been powered up, but the door may not be open. Usually people don't power it up and out, but yes, fair point. Sure. The vehicle's not there anyway. try and come back into this raid. My SJ6 is just wearing off and I'm just at the train. Okay. Well, I'm out of my scav run already. I am getting stamina back as I walk. not much and it is not fast. That's fine. Right, let's duck 
into this rock, pack a mag. I had used 16 bullets. I'm almost at the military checkpoint. I just checked, you now can't wear anything with that CQCM ballistic mask. Well, I think that's... Just, just ears only. That's good, because it was a bit broken before. Well, without SJ6, I'm not actually getting stamina back. That's fine. a very slight loss as I walk. That is manageable. Even in front of Sniper Tower, I'm not really seeing any uh, any scabs down there. So I don't know where they all are this time. Well, you got one. <laughs> yeah. Revenge is important. I would go hunting for more, but I really don't want to risk your stuff. Oh, that's very kind. Okay. Ten minutes remaining, and I'm in the area at the water towers. So barring any unexpected exit campers, should be good. Speaking of, um, changes coming for 1.0. A new boss who hunts people down based on their PMC karma. And one example of losing PMC karma would be waiting near the exfil for minutes on end for someone to come along and murdering That's, them. I'm not sure how I feel about that. I, I think It's one example of something that they might do. I'm extracting now. Cool. So I like, don't know how they could force that as karma. But like, if, if you uh, it's probably just like time not moving within the vicinity of blah 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 area. Okay, I have made it out, and I have all of your stuff. Nice. Because this backpack is amazing. It is very good. Uh, so, 16 ammo used, 2 hits. So that's kind of terrible. That was 1 hit as he ran across, and 1 hit um, in the back of his head. So... 
So now I need eight. Uh, I just need a second to uh, get more drinks and bring some money this time for the uh, car extract. Yes, I'm putting money in for the car extract as well, because I didn't forget either. <laughs> Excuse me. So your dog tank goes in my collection of your dog tanks. Oh, I'm taking... Mm, yeah, I'm taking the L1. No, I'll leave you the L1. I'll leave you the L1. It's a bit of a rubbish painkiller. Uh, so I'll be bringing your armor, your rig, your helmet, and your gun, which I will be reloading for you. Oh, thank you. Uh, would you like LPS? Would you like BT? Would you like BS? I would take BT out of those three. BT it is. If you have spare PS, I would take I PS. I do not have spare PS. PS. <laughs> should just be one in the chamber and 20 in the mag because that's all I got all right. a chance to fire. Yeah, you've got... Uh, so there was nothing in the chamber. Uh, so you're getting... Yeah. Uh, you're getting a BT in the chamber, a BS as your first bullet, and then BT for all the rest. All right, let me have a quick look at BS. I can, so, I can swap it around so it's the last one in there if you want. I don't normally fire BS, so I want to know what's in my gun, that's all. Uh, it is 70 pen as opposed to 55... Oh, wow. Holy shit. And 72 damage as opposed to 78. Feel free to put the BS as the first bullet okay. in, the, in the chamber. I, yeah. I've only got four BS bullets, so I was like... <laughs> don't, like I, I would say don't waste that on me. Uh, it's it's one bullet. I've got three yeah. more. <laughs> uh, yeah, so you're going to want to bring a pistol and, I guess, a backpack, which you can then throw away once you get in. That's pretty much what I'm bringing. Uh, right, so I need drinks. Oh, and you're going to want to bring drinks. Yes. Yes, of course. So, drink. 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 I also got a Vaseline out of that. Which is alright. I need money. Money from here. And uh, let's top that up. Okay, so brain, brain. Go got, away. I've got, <laughs> come again another day. <laughs> That's uh, how that goes, right? Yeah, totally, totally. Uh, right, so you've still got your Salawa, so that's fine. You've got your Caloric. I'll give you a spare ES mark. I'll take a spare ES mark myself. I think all good to go. Uh, I'm going to insure your stuff, and that's going to cost me 70k. I know, it's ridiculous, isn't it? I mean, money's easy to come by. 70k is, a sca is like less than a scav run. That's a mighty big backpack to bring in for something you're going to... I suppose you don't have to throw it away, do you? So this gun and this backpack came from the scavron that I just did. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose it's it's less money than selling yeah, that selling and, and buying, buying a new... something. <laughs> yeah, that's... That's why I'm using this gun as well. I'm like, well, I could bring a pistol or I could just use this gun that I just got for nothing. Yeah. And actually, right, it's going to be rapid fire. Should the emergency happen, mm. I can switch to gun. Uh, we, uh, we just watched the escape room uh, episode of Game Changer. Oh. <laughs> right. <laughs> I love that so much. <laughs> it was so good. <laughs> Shouting at the camera person in the parking lot. 
<laughs> poor, poor person. Did you see the... Um, I can't remember if it's part of that episode or if it's part of the behind the scenes, but he shows how he gets into the bathroom again. Oh, no, no, I haven't seen that. You should watch the behind the scenes because it's quite fun because it, uh, it talks about the collaboration with mm. this person that does escape rooms. Yeah. I mean, being able to control stuff like the lighting, the, the locks and, and stuff, either you've got a lot of people doing doing bits to help or you need to know where you're moving throughout it, like if you need to be part of it. I thought it was very smart, the fact that they uh, they had him on the TV initially and they were able to talk with him. And then at some point they just... I think it was when he was like hiding behind the podium. They uh... No, 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 no. It's simpler than that. It's when they all went into the red room and went, oh, wow. He just walked <laughs> through the room. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Yeah, so at the moment I've got the skull face mask and I'm wearing condors underneath it. I'm sure that can't be comfortable. Well, the best I've seen was skull face mask with condors underneath it and the class three um, fast MT yeah, face shield. Face shield. On top. Maximum head protection. Uh, when we get in, uh, let's find, like, make sure we're safe. Um, most of your stuff is in my backpack. Uh, the only thing that's not is your gun, uh, and we can probably put that somewhere safe. Yeah. Risky. Reskeet for a beeskeet. Um, this is relatively dangerous, but let's go behind here. Hey, my uh, gun's flashlight is still on. You've had that on this whole time. Okay, I'm going to drop your gun on the floor here because I think this is safe yeah, enough. Thank you for everything. You are welcome. I should have taken some of the other crap out. Oh well. Oh, interesting. All the stuff that I had already was searched. Like, as in I knew what it yeah. was because it was my stuff from before. That's so weird. Cool. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Just looting for XP and throwing stuff away. Sure. I don't like being in here. I think we should leave. Okay. Do you want to go to our spot that we were at a second ago? Yeah. Do you want to clear behind us first? I don't know if it's really going to be possible to. So I'd say... So let me go out to the right and then clear behind us. I'd say let's just book it to the edge and then we can listen. I'm going to head to the back left door. That sounds like someone launching a flare. Okay, I'm out. I'm a little ahead of you. Well, I see a scav over there, zeroing. Walking behind you. 
Got him. Gonna get into my building. My building. My truck. Scav is still there. Same scav or different scav? Don't know. He's at the front. I don't see him from here. He might be behind the tree just now. To, just to the left of the truck. Different scav. Gonna take him. Cool. Two scavs. Thank you. Okay, gonna pack a mag. Still playing guard GT. So I'm kind of half looking to see if I can see the scav that would be on top over the other side for sniping, but I don't see him up there. No, I don't see him, and I've got a great scope. I've got an Elcan, so. Likewise, it's a great scope. It is a perfectly serviceable scope. That's such a shame you dying to the shotgun, Scav. What really annoys me is that uh, it must have been desync to some degree because I was facing away from him with my head pointed down and I got shot in the head. Yeah. Which shouldn't be possible from the angle that he had on me. So I do that while I reload because it protects your head. Mm. There's another scav. Uh, first scav's position, deleting him. Okay. I see. Yep, you got him. He's dead. He does not look dead on mine. Believe me, he's dead. He's like face down in the railing. Oh, maybe he just flop, flop, flopped forwards a like bit. A okay, yeah, he's not flopping on mine. So, packing mag. Because I was like, the first time I shot, I was like, I'm sure that's a blood splatter I can see. I'm going to check to see how many more I need quickly. It's time for second drink, by the way. Alright. Peacekeeping mission, I need five more. Hoping for another one over near the second one. It's crazy how. Footsteps, footsteps behind us. I hear. If I don't see them, they must be underneath. No. Oh no, I see a head. Got one. Got one. Did you get the other? Yeah. Nice. I think. Yeah. I got Sorry, the one I with got the. one because I thought they were players. I got the one on the right, you got the one on the left. I got that. Yeah, I got the one with the black hat. But I'm going to double check if that was a scav. I think they were scavs. After I shot, I was like, it does not look like people. Uh, yes, it was a scav. Cool. Right, packing mag. So. Apologies for taking a kill from you. Don't apologise, it's all good. I just need four more. So that was your expensive bullet. <laughs> bullet well spent. Okay, I'm going to move back out onto the floor. Okay. So crossing in front of you to the right. I hear it. Scav down in the middle. Yeah, scav in the middle. 
crossing right. the cro crossing the land bridge. On our side or the far side? He's approaching red container. He's on the left of the red container, okay. passing up the red container. He's now heading up past the other side, going underneath the things. Oh, right, uh, going the away from us. Yes. Right, I see him. Yeah, he dead. Oh no, he just hit the. Now he dead. Now he's dead. Yeah, Kevin, this is a, a really good day to be doing this kind of sniping. Right, three to go. Gonna pack a mag. That was way more bullets than I needed, but... Well, it wasn't, because you stopped shooting when you killed him. That was exactly as many bullets as you needed. Scouts behind us. I heard voices. I'm not going up and leaving that to you. Don't see them on the left. I might go down and in. Sure. Right, changing my zero ring to 50. Let me know if you want accompaniment. No, I should be good. The biggest question is going to be figuring out where they've gone in here. I hear running. You might hear me moving around a bit. Got him. I hear his friend. Yep. Gonna kill. I'm in your train car. Oh, there's one over by Big Red. Underneath the windows for the office. Right, got him. I'm bleeding, so coming back. Do you need anything? No. I think I only need one more scav. I don't know if that was the one that you were talking about. Was he right underneath the window? There's another scav opposite us. Uh, over to the left. Okay. A bit further left Coming. than the uh, original two that you killed. I hear another one running. Got him. Cool. There's another one. I'm just going to leave him. Right, I'm going to come in and pack a mag in the back. Sure. Crossing on your your left. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just you were aiming. I was like, I'm not going to run up just as you put a bullet out. Uh, right, let's take you to dorms. Uh, there will be still a scab in there if you're going to do looting and touching stuff. Just killing scabs opposite. Okay. So you've not gone in... No, no, no. I'm, I'm in the upturned train car at the moment. Okay, I see you. Alright. Coming to you. I'm gonna pack that one bullet. Sure. So, Landbridge. This one or the other? No, the other. Because we're going to dorms. I'm going to drink my next drink. Oh, I think I drank all of mine. That is my last one. Oh yeah, you drink three, don't you? Yeah. At the moment, just because I've got so many. Yeah, someone def. I heard a scav shouting. Yeah. Some 
bridge behind us in the compound. Okay. That's kind of going slap bang in the middle of everything. Yeah. Uh, I think we go under, actually. I think we go under and we go up the far side. I don't know what you mean by under. Like under the bridge. Oh, right. Okay. Coming back then. Yeah, I'm under the bridge at the moment. Because I figure that's likely to get everyone looking out and um, being hugely exposed at that point might not be good for us. My head up. Crossing over. Fine. My intention is going to be to go straight up to the third floor. Straight along, get the door open. As I'm passing, I will look to see if the vehicle extract is there. But I can't really see it. That sounds like it's in third story. So this might be a mistake, but... No guts, no glory. Bottom door is open. I hear movement. That's me. Okay. Okay, gonna open. Get yourself in. Tool. I will take that. I'm not going to touch your marker. 20 seconds more. There is more. someone out the back. Yeah, you're making spin sounds in turn. Two, one, zero, done. Okay. So we can leave now. Back out the front, I'd say. You can take the gun if you want. If you want the MP153. No, it's alright. I think straight to the other side of the little hut that's down there. Sound good? Okay, from here across to bus station. Yeah. Oh, there's that fucking airdrop. I'm going for it. Whereabouts is it? Oh, there. On the main road. Okay. Sure. I'm going to sit in this container here. The airdrop weapon crate. On metal. That's me. That's probably you.
Yeah, they uh, whoever that was, they took the dorms vehicle extract. Uh. Okay. Coming over to you. Okay, I think we go along the back of the bus station. Unless you want to push in the front of it. Nope. Along the back is fine. Give a scab in the road. I think mostly we try and ignore scab engagements. I agree. So we could go wide, wide. No, we don't need to go that wide. Okay. Well, at least up the hill rather than behind gas station, I'd say. Just, just in case Vishala's goons are there. Although I do need to kill the police one more time. But I'll do that on a time when I'm hunting Vishala rather than just accidentally in the area. Although I do have a grenade. I could throw a grenade over there. I've got grenades as well. I now have an impact grenade. Oh, very nice. Weapon drop. I don't see any obvious Rishala out the back. an itch before we get into the next danger area. Just looking. Don't see a sniper scab there. Want to go through here? Uh, yeah. See some dead scabs. Crossing. Gonna go round the outside. Dead body out here. Just touching. Yeah, there's a dead body there as well. I'm gonna go wide if you're going through. I've gone through, through in the building inner. Yep, there's blood splats. I hear someone inside, I think, or in a bush. In a bush yeah, just up ahead. Here, oh god, I'm dead! <sighs> well, achieved the mission. I'm not convinced by them. And I'll explain why when you're safe.
They are super, super sus. They're not playing too sus at the moment, gotta say. Hmm. Don't forget your grenades. I use them. No. Oh, I do have another one actually. Got him. Well done. So, if I might recommend... Hold on a minute. Uh, uh, right. I think he ditched his gun. Level 14? Fucking hell. Yeah. No way. Piece uh, of shit. And he's had 38 raids. Which means he's got 152,000 experience across 38 raids. Yeah. Uh, what a piece of shit. But, uh, I am 100% reporting this arsehole. Six, 6k XP is possible per raid, but he's got no, like, barely any achievements. His kill death ratio doesn't um, reflect the way. He plays. Now, my death could have been completely legitimate. No, no. He had, uh, he's got three dog tags on him at least. Yeah. And he's using M855, which oh. is like the cheaters. No, uh, he gun. went in with no gun. He went yeah, into that raid with no gun. The most sus person I think I've ever mm. seen. Um, right, so if I might recommend, if you wear my stuff... You can put all of your stuff in my backpack. Uh, busy doing a few logistics. Yeah, yeah, of course. Hopefully. Let me move his stuff over there. Drop my black frog. Take his alpha. But yeah, I died uh, to 762 by 39 PS. Which is fair enough. Just a Bit of a shame after such a good raid. Well done for getting him, though. Thanks. Man, I really want that M4. What, my M4? No, 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 no. Because I want his mechanism and the TV. Like, there's a there's an M4 that is for Gunsmith Part 22. I can just buy one. It's yeah. Fine. And that's probably someone's M4 who's died to him. And he's thinking, well, I'm never going to get that stuff back. Yeah, probably. Right, do you want anything from your 
body. Everything? Okay, then I can't take any of his stuff. No, no, no. I, so, I, I honestly no, don't that's mind. Fine. This guy over here has a pilgrim. Right. <laughs> I... Oh, God. It's a pilgrim that's full because that's this loot lord thing. Yeah. Holy shit. Which means all the stuff in there is ill gotten gains. Doesn't mean I don't want it. No. Okay. Um, I don't mind if it doesn't come back. Um, I'm going to put my key tool and my uh, politician Mutkevich figurine uh, in my stash. Uh, and I'm going to pop to the loo while you're doing your logistics. So, right, so if I'm not taking any of that, I'll be back I'll in a bit. Take this instead of that. They're fine to leave. They're fine to leave. Hi, Luma. This guy had razors. It's kind of okay. Oh, he had a Bagari. I do like those. every person in the server. What a piece of shit. Okay, so Alex wants his thing back. I'm going to have to put some of this away. Contact fours. I'm taking those instead of these. Sixty can come out. And correct that. Let's go this and this. Let's see what we can get of Alex's. The gun is probably the most important thing, but. Okay, so if I'm bringing this, someone is getting their AK back. It's not the chap you just killed because he went in without a gun. Right, your rig. Can... If the rig's too much hassle, I can bring another rig. Let me see what I can do. So you found a vector in there? Yeah, in the marked room. Oh, yes, okay. So, assuming I'm dropping that. Yeah. So I'm dropping the gas analyzer. Yeah. Your gun fits in. No, it doesn't. Your gun fits in there. So your rig would go in here. Your armor would go in here. And I can't bring your helmet. That's okay. That. Does this fit in there? Hmm. If I drop everything else. Oh, I like, really want to help. Uh, hmm. Gun, gun okay. is most important. I'm... Everything else is superfluous. That can go here, this can go here. So I'm doing that. Can I just you can I bring your bag as well? Let's have a look. If I'm doing that, does this fit nicely then? Yes, okay. I can bring that. Okay, I've got some of your bits. Not much. Thank you. So the bits that I don't have are your helmet and your tax sports and your death shadow. Okay. That's no no problem. And death shadow yeah, didn't so. exactly help. So Yeah, this guy exit camped every single person on the server. I I'll go through all the dog tags as soon as I'm out. Wow. Uh, once you're out, I'll just double check if you're bringing my condors. I am out. I'm not bringing your condors. Okay, that's okay, fine. Let me double check. I'm pretty sure I didn't. Yeah, I hit him ten times. Uh, sorry, nine times because I killed that one scab with a headshot. Yeah. 
he hit me with 855, but it basically just bounced off my arm. <laughs> You're lucky he didn't get you in in the eyes. Yes, yes, I am. Uh, I was. Um, so he was definitely an ESP. Yeah. It wasn't an A boxer. At least uh, not obviously. It could have been set up for torso because you could change where they aim. Sure, but there's points where he uh, basically missed, and then yeah. for torso he wouldn't have done so. But I did have my flashlight on all the time going towards him, so I'm thinking you probably couldn't see whatever overlay was past <laughs> his screen. Okay, so you were killed by uh, P1 Sayapopa. Yeah. Uh, let me do Yeah, it, peep, uh, your pa peep your papa. I think it was something stupid like. So, if you use this profile, then let me just report this motherfucker. Uh, reports this is suspicious profile. I mean, honestly, using uh, cheats like that and still sucking, it's like, what, what a shit lord. Okay, so he killed you. Killed. Uh, uh, ooh, actually, this is interesting. We've, we've got a uh, round robin of people killing each other here. So, uh, this, this person, oh, where's their name? And, so, and well was killed by Apollon 2. He might have had a friend then. Bumbleet was killed by the Nailstorm. The Nailstorm was killed by Beryl. Uh, Apollon 2 was killed by Beryl. So Beryl's killed two people so far. Beryl was killed by Sayapopa. Bart 646 was killed by the Nailstorm. So yeah, it looks like the Nailstorm and uh, Sayapopa were exit camping. Maybe one of them left. I would explain why I did so much damage. Uh, I now have some real problematic logistics uh, <laughs> to work through. Hey, I, I just appreciate you grabbing what you can. So, I need to move some of these dog tags into my dog tag case, which has one spot left and then it's full. Oh my god, wow. I'm going to turn in some of these for counteraction, I think. Uh, so, let me just do that quickly. Uh, can, I, can I sort this when it's full? Sort... Yes. And then trading. Peacekeeper. Peacekeeper's happy because I marked the thing. Thank you very much for the help. In that. Hey, happy. Counteraction. Turn in. Okay. So let's say anything under 35 is now fair game. So 33, 33, 33, 33, 32, 30, 30, 30, 31, 31. Uh, let's say 35 as well. And a 36. Sure. So, 20 bear dog tags handed in for counteraction, and that's freed up some spaces. Not many, some. That's, uh... You have your condors. I did grab them at the last second. Okay, thank you. Uh, so, you've got my tactical rig. Uh, let me tell you what I've got. I do not have your tactical rig. Okay, grabbing my... I have your gun and your backpack only, and your condors. <laughs> but... <laughs> So I not so not them. my body armor. No, not your body armor. Okay, uh, that's I, fine. I took like so much more stuff because uh, if I if I taken your body armor and your untie helmet, which to be honest, you can just yeah. buy cheapest shit. That's fine. Uh, this guy would not have suffered as much. That, well, the thing is, why... he went into the raid with nothing. He went in with the TV ten, and that's it. Well, I'm glad that I trashed his TV ten then. <laughs> go here um right so i will be selling this in pieces i've got some contact force for myself from some poor sod so Sorry. did you say my gun and my backpack yes your gun and your backpack right so i need meds for uh and an afac for you one that you had part used by the look of it actually i can give you plenty of meds as well oh I've, I've got i've got plenty of meds it's just so i don't end up wanting so four, five. Uh, so this is a full, uh, a near full Salawa and an AFAC and an ALU splint, which may have been yours in the first place. I don't uh, know. No, it's not. It's not mine. But the CMS kit would have been. But I suspect that's gone. It is gone. That's fine. I've got a spare. I've got loads of spares. Right. So that's four, five, six spare ammo. Um, you didn't get my spare magazine, so I will grab a magazine. 
Well, I do have a spare mag 60 for you from some poor sod. That might be mine. A spare mag 60? Oh, a spare. not from you. Uh, yeah. Bring that out. I don't mind using two mag 60s. <laughs> and I will load it with 856 as well. Actually, what's in this one as well? And I've got a Gen 3 for you with. Oh, no, that's got 855. Let's replace that with something good. Uh, uh, you can have some SOST in that one. So, this is, this is going there. That's going there. That's that. That goes there. So, let's try this again. Load this back up with. Yes, I am going to have to totally swap all my uh, everything as well, actually. Because we're going to be peacekeeping somewhere else. Yes, we're going to interchange. So I can bring you a respirator. Uh, no, it's all right. I, I have a respirator. So you want... I need to swap this gun for that gun. Sorting table. Sorting table's now at the top if uh, if you haven't yes, seen. Yes, yeah. yeah. So you've got your full mag 60. Uh, there's a spare mag 60 for you here. Spare gen 3 for you here. So that's... I will still be some time. Okay, that's... Not to be that's... If you want to go into a scav run, that's completely fine. I'm, I might do. I'm just, uh, just repositioning stuff in my inventory. Right. Uh, leave group... Uh, did you say you're not bringing my backpack? I will be bringing my Okay, perfect. Right, I'll do a scav run quickly. Let's go into factory. I, I really appreciate you bringing this, this stuff back. Like, it's it's almost like tax on the game that you run into cheaters. You're going to lose stuff, but it just... Yes, it saves a lot of that extra headache of, right, what was this build? What am I doing with it? Yeah. Oh, God. Exactly I've that. I've now got some interesting logistics that I'm not sure I can be bothered to figure out, so I might come in with a pilgrim that I immediately discuss. <laughs> uh, I don't want to use this ULAC, so I'll just be setting it. These are your condors, so I need to save those. Uh, these are the meds for you, so that can stay there. Uh, so that means that. This CPC can come out now, and I can sell bits in it at any time. Uh, did, did get a grenade launcher, an underpower grenade launcher from that, but I'm not sure I care enough to keep it. In fact, I'm just going to sell most of this. Uh, yeah, I've got like four, so if we ever decide to do underbarrel grenade stuff, I can like bring you one. Because I've been saving them since the start of the wipe. My original plan had been to take them onto streets like we did two wipes ago. Um, but then Street's performance was just so bad, it, it wasn't practical. Oh, wow, I found a toilet paper stash from Factory. Uh, great. That's enough toilet paper for at least three curries. Okay, this M4, do I actually like it? Um... I mean, I need to be using an M4 for peacekeeping missions, yeah. so sure, I'll bring this one out. Why not? Yeah, you're, you're all not precious about the particular build. I don't have anywhere to put this spare gun. Hold on a minute. Let's go to my uh, hideout and have a look, see if my gun rack has got space. Not really on this side. Let's go sorting table then. I'll do it this way around. Yeah, that goes there, that goes there. Comes off. That goes there. So, if I'm bringing that and that for you, I need a couple of spare for me. It's, uh, Shadow is coming off for me. Respirator is going on. 
Oh, I've got to switch over to my untar and stuff as well. Yeah. Yep. Right, time to make a gun smaller so that I can fit more guns in my thing. SVD house found. My best shadow can go there. Right, I've got a little bit of room to maneuver some things now. So Defender can come out, Bastion can come out, Body Armor can go untar, Headwear can go untar. Right, time to get out. Let's go. What's in this? 856A1, sure, that's fine. No, 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 no. 856A1, I can go there. We're going to interchange, you say? Yeah. XPS 3-0 is fine for that, I suppose. Get two spare Stanags for myself. this gun like? Looks alright, pretty simple. Don't need this eyewear, I can sell that. Where, anywhere that I can throw this stuff? No, no. Well, I suppose I can sort of throw that there, it's fine. Right, let's take the tolls. That means we're not going to be tagged and cursed. I was hoping it would get enhanced. All right, let's uh, sell the rest of this stuff. Oh, actually, I might be able to do something smart in terms of my stupid logistics. Well, that scav run got me more money than I spent on insuring your stuff. So, it just goes to show how quickly it comes. Drinks, that's what I'm going to take. Drinks. Oh, I need to get a new SJ6 as well. I don't need PS bullets, they can come out. Xbox 6A1 can come in instead. Uh, Doc's case can come out and be replaced with my sick case. So I've got the key for inner key, and I've got the safe room key card. I've got the Emicon medical key. I've got Emicon medical as well. Oh yeah, that's a very good point. We can... Uh, Hop in and do that. So I'm gonna put your gun and uh, your meds collection in your backpack. Uh, it is just your gun, your meds, your backpack, and your glasses. I'll, I'll repair your glasses. Uh, it's not worth it. It's for me. Okay. <laughs> uh, I suppose if I got shot in the eye, then they may have been even more damaged than they were before. They, they were at six. Yes, they were at 19 when I went into that raid. So yes, you got shot in the eye. Now I can come down. These, uh, 
these go in here for you. Yes, you are extra max. I need my drinks. So that and that come over. That's a six and a seven. I need another one of these. This is spare five. So it's five, five, five. Got my painkiller, which I didn't use in the end. Um, cool. Okay, I think I'm finally okay to go. Sorry about the massive. No, that. no problem at all. My stash looks like a nightmare, as I'm sure you can imagine. At some point, I'm just going to be like, right, I have to sell this Thor because I'm never going to wear it properly. Uh, do I need to heal? Yes, ha having a third thick has actually made a huge difference for me. Okay, so escape from Tarkov, DMC interchange. Uh, do you want to go morning or night? I've got no objection either way. Early afternoon then. Cool. I am insuring your guns and everything. Thank you. For what? Oh, 189k. <laughs> that's got to be more than just my stuff that's costing you that. <laughs> yeah, so 50k is the gun that I took off that random person. Wow. Uh, your stuff is 90k. Yeah, that's about what I was expecting. S somewhere between 70 and 90 Am I going to ensure that pilgrim? Sure, why not? Let's ensure all. So on top. Ooh, do I want to? Ch no, I'm I'm suitably coloured. Suitably coloured for interchange. This uh, kind of like bluey coal colour. Yeah, I do not have a long range scope, just to warn you. Yeah, lightly dusted tarmac. Yeah, kind of like this top would be blue if I ever washed it. So the good news about that PMC killer is I only need two more for Punisher. <laughs> yes, that is a really good thing. That's probably the best news about that encounter. But seriously, that guy is like so shady. He was down the far side of the bank with his head poking between the um, railway tracks. No way he saw me from there. Uh, well, yes. I mean, I was at his position and I couldn't see shit, so... So he was he... He had oh. no idea where I was when I was in the building, so... Shrug? Maybe he turned it on, turned it off, turned it on, turned it off. Possibly. In fact, if he's trying to avoid getting a high KD, he could have been like, this is the last player on the map. Maybe. Let's just die and recycle, go in with a knife on the next one. Who knows? There is, of course, every every possibility that he is legit and just a really, really good player, like maybe someone with an EOD who's been in since the beginning, who's reset their account, and they consistently get 6 to 8k every single raid. But then why would you be able to beat them? Yes. <laughs> that's so, that's not to... So, so much about this that just does not add up. That's, that's not to say that you couldn't. Uh, and it is very satisfying getting kills against obviously experienced people but yeah anyway i reported them i hope you reported oh, them. oh yeah i reported That's them twice I'm sure the three people that they killed probably reported them as well so i reported them twice i reported them for suspected cheat use on the kill screen and then for um, suspicious profile. Mm. I could only do the latter. Oh. 
I was uh, I was reading an article a couple of weeks ago about um, someone who makes cheats for uh, competitive video games like this, except they go out of their way to make um, cheats that will troll the cheaters. So things like on CSGO, if you select your flashbang and um, click to throw it, it will just drop it at your feet rather than actually throwing it. Oh, uh, yeah. I, I, uh, that's a few years old, that. Um, uh, but the, the, like that's that's an example of the type of, uh, of trolling. Rather slow matching. It is. Interchange is clearly not uh, in vogue at the moment. Well, we'll give it till five minutes and then we'll try back again. And we'll yeah. cycle it and try again. Did you remember a respirator for your person? I'm wearing one, yes. Good. Has to be under 60 metres to count. Alright. That's why you don't have a long range scope. I mean, that's not why I don't have Oh, one. because, it's yeah, the, the gun didn't have one. The gun didn't didn't have one. one. Here we go. Yeah. As long as it's not uh, Fisher Papa coming in the same raid with us. I prefer misreading it properly. <laughs> PS1 Po P0. Uh... Maybe it's a cipher. Quick, try and decode it! Sure. Let me just get my secret decoder ring out. <laughs> works, works on everything. A-P-P-L-E! -P -P what does it mean? <laughs> Wherever we start, we're likely to need to move to get somewhere vaguely safe. Oh, this is not too bad, actually. All right, yeah. There you go. Thanks. I'm so glad that my my gun fits in the bottom of the <laughs> of the thing. Uh, I would have just taken the uh, suppressor off. Right. Okay. Do you want to just go straight in underneath? Sure. So, aside from scabs and scabs and scabs... You need a couple of PMC are... kills. But no, not, not in here I don't. I don't have an SVD. Ah, oh, yeah. Scab, scab running up the uh, ramp. I got him. Thanks for stealing the kill. Happy to help. Sorry, thank you. Uh, which underneath do you want to go in? To the right or to the ramp? I, I would say to the right. Okay, that's fine by me. I'm going to go far, far right. Push behind the containers. Oh, I should drop this pilgrim. Going to... Pack my mag quickly. Drop, drop the pilgrim. Yeah, so uh, the book that's upstairs near the uh, uh, tech shop, I need. Ah, yeah. The clothes designs, I think I also need them. Both of them, but. So I have the downstairs one. I'm less fussed yeah. about those. I'm happy to go in here, happy to go to power station. Let's go in here first. Oh yeah, that, that kill would have counted for peacekeeping, but not decon. Yes.
let's go try and get you that book because we can always like come back in and out and in and out and in and out. Sure. Do you want to go up here? Yeah. Or through. Okay. Because then we can go in Goshan. Uh, no, sorry, not in. Well, in the back of any of them really, and upstairs from there. Them. Scab at the front of the store. Yeah. I see someone moving, uh, probably the scab moving right to left. So he just passed through that um, smoky gap bit. Scab on the left. I'm going to get the one on the left if I can. Okay. Got him. I'm packing a mag. I got one further down. Okay. I think we head to the uh, computer rooms and stairs over at the right. What do you think? No, off to the left if we're going off upstairs with the book. Off to the left, okay. Steps off to our right, behind us now, hopefully. Could have been weird sound echoes from you, I suppose, but. Okay, I'm with you. Okay, I'm just having a very quick cursory glance. Coming through and closing door. Uh, yeah, it is time for a second drink. This is me. Hello. Uh, so, <laughs> mm, yeah. Closing. I'm going to pack a mag just next to you. Did you get badly injured? Uh, took out an arm. I'm alright. We've got CMS if you need. No, no. So it's the bookshop that should be off to our right. If memory serves. Okay. Kind of that one. Yeah. Uh, my, my three air uh, ectoplasm. Yeah. And it's in a pile on the floor. I'll go in it this bit. Usually in a pile on the floor. Now 
slow down to a walk. Oh, here it is. You walk right past it. Ah. I'm stood on it. Ah, right. Yeah. Got it. Okay, let's just step in here for a second. Uh, right, extract. We could go to the power station. Wait, wait. Oh, I heard someone running and was, stopped. Was not me. Yeah, I did. Yeah. There's a scab person just running past the store. I see. Going to move up for them. Sorry, he was running at me, so... I mean, he kind of was, but also really wasn't. So, uh, power station? Sure. So we could go back... I'm packing a mag. Again. Yeah, we, we could go back down the way we just came up. And across the back of Goshan. Sounds fine. Let's check in the theatre quickly for like, food and stuff. Just while we're here. Closing door. Got an AI too. Uh, nothing else that I can see. Gonna hit the symbol. Disappointed. Musical. Should have done the. Oh, there's no cowbell. Uh, right, so it was back over to the right. Yes. Sure, oh, Ali has a flight. Going in urban clothes. Coming to catch you up. Running to catch okay. you up. Okay, yeah. I'm just in urban clothes. Alarms are on. Yeah. All well, the power is on at the power station. I feel like this is a good thing. Safe room, Exfil. Yeah, power's definitely been turned on. I changed zone between the doors. So you still want to go to the power station? I think it's our best plan for getting out. Did you want to use the vehicle extract? Yes. Yeah. Because there is the hole in the fence right next to it as well. There is, but that means dropping You would have to leave your backpack, pack. obviously. That just feels like yeah, I guess I was bad wrong, luck. By the way. Sorry? I guess I was wrong. About there being someone down here. Yeah. Unless they're like under under. You've stood up now so I can hear you walking. I have, yeah. Yeah, there's no one there. Okay. I was just wrong. Do you want to have a look in the um, maintenance room? Sure. I mean, you could do a nice thing and turn, turn off, off the, the alarms. Alarm Got some noodles if... Uh, if you get hungry. 
I've got an Iskras there. Sounds like an airdrop. Maybe one of those raids then. Very nice. Stick that in your prison pocket. Yeah, like my CMS kit now, aren't So I think we head to the back, but not through, and then we go to the food section, and then we cut through over there. How does that sound? Sounds good. I think... Go ahead. He's still alive. So one on the right. There's three over there, actually. You got the first one. I've got one. I can't see them. It's just on the other side of the thing. I was just thinking we should probably get closer for the decon, but... Yeah, good point. I'm going to pack a mag, though, quickly. I'm running up. Did we get him already? I don't think so. Just drinking, and then I'm going to come and join. I think okay. he did. I mean, there's another guy around there, for sure. Oh, there's a guy behind me. I'm moving to him. Got him. That nice. was definitely close range. Hi. On the right, I heard footsteps. Got one. Yeah, cool. I got one distance though. Gonna pack a few bullets. Okay. I'm down to my last uh, couple of mags. Okay, I'm with you. Okay. Coming to the back. I'm just packing. Right. Hear more footsteps near me. I think he's going to be at the front of the store. He's coming round to my left. He's still alive. You want to kill him? Close range? Oh, no, there's another guy behind me. All right, I'll get this guy then. <coughs> yeah, you get that guy. Got him. <laughs> this guy just like spawned where I had just looked. Are you running? No, no, no. I'm at the back of the store now. By the by, the gap between the two. Okay, there might be someone running then. Moving up. Walking? It, yep. Yeah. Hi. I still need to pack a bit, but... Alright, let's go to the food bit. <laughs> I see, yeah, you've got a guy out there in the back. Two guys, I think, actually. I don't know if that was one or two that I killed, or if it was one that was looting a second. So I think we should dive in here, not actually go for the food. Sounds fine. 
and I can pack a mag properly in this uh, this little room over here. Door is open. Going to close the second door here. done packing. Right, I'm good. I've gone a little bit to your right. Sure. Checking X bills. Vehicle is still question mark. I see a scab moving up the ramp over the far side, right to left. So he's going to be coming along the top. So I'm going to move. I have the right scope for him, so I'm going to move closer. You can also come closer if you want to get a close kill. I'm coming up, but just to support. Yeah. He's running on the outside. He's down. Fucking bullets between magazines. I can drop the spare mag if you want. No, it's alright. The Gen 3. So I've got 30 in one and I'm going to be almost full in the second. Okay. But which is fine for now. And then I have two bullets spare. And then I've got a different gun if I need it. Yeah, but that's not peacekeeping. Hard drive and PSU. I'm moving up. And a grenade. Coming to catch you up. Bullet. Whereabouts? I, it just went whiz. That's that's all I heard. Okay. There is a dead scab in the parking lot down there. Okay, coming to catch you up. This feels so sketch. I'll go around the outside. Okay. I'm pushing in. Checking the showers. No one in the showers. Car is here. Checking the main computer room. No one in the main computer room. Going. Okay, I will be out in just a second. Oh, I didn't bring money. Uh, I've got 10,000. Cool. So do you want to come into the main computer room and we'll do a little okay. trade? Right, I'm going to leave 5,000 in this jacket. Okay, it's in there. I'll go get the car started. There is no stash over here. I'm just coming. Oh, there is a dead body here, though. Uh, do I want that toss? Can I fit that toss? Can't fit that toss. Let's just take that, that, seconds. that. Do not panic. I'm going to empty this magazine. 
Okay, I'm coming around the edge. Don't shoot me. No. Okay, 16 seconds. Uh, I'm also going to empty a magazine. Don't panic. Four, three, two, yeah. Please stop shooting. <laughs> <laughs> Successful extract. Um, Kevin, there is a there's a fair number of cheats in game. Yeah, uh, the sanctions to curtail it. Uh, if they catch anyone, they ban them. But their detection is woefully inadequate. Um, the only redeeming feature is the game is so much fun; it's addictive. Um, so people just rumble and get past it. All right, that was seven scav kills for me. And uh, same for me as well in the end. One, two, three, four, five, six work within sixty meters. Oh, I didn't check that. Uh one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All of them. Uh one was fifty nine point three meters. Oh. Fifty seven point three meters. <laughs> one was fifty five point eight meters. I'd like to say I'm on point. So so that one like across the back of Goshan that you were like, I got one in the distance. I thought that was easily gonna be a hundred meters away. That was the fifty nine point nine. Yes. I think that went well. So we hand in the book. Yes. And next time maybe we go to Emicom or get the other book that I need. I mean, next time we go to Emicom, Mantis, get the other book. They were all in the same area. Yeah. We both need five more uh, peacekeeping kills. Yeah. And like... 50 more decon, decon. <laughs> definitely bringing more ammo next time I forgot how much I burst through ammo with this gun yeah oh, right. I wish you could sell stuff direct from your inventory it, uh, it, it's... yeah it, it would be very handy wouldn't it it would Okay, did I get anything actually legitimately interesting from that? Mostly I'm just putting this all on my to sell later thing. Uh, let's use that. To sell later slash to figure out later. That's what I should call it. Oh, you can't put ammo boxes in an items case. That seems like an oversight. Um, right, that drive comes down. I used 53 bullets. Uh, I used uh, 90. But... You did. Feel, <laughs> feel, like, after I like put twenty bullets into like the direction of them, like twice. I mean that that's I the thing, isn't it? You put twenty bullets in the direction of them, and I was like, "Is he gonna get this thing?" Oh, there we go. To be fair, each time I stole a kill, it was a headshot. And that that very first one going up the ramp, that was the only one that was too far. That was hundred meters. Serves you right. That's all I can say. Uh, right, I need more drinks and more money so another 10,000 that comes out also must remember hand in the book hand in the book oh yeah I also finished sales night apparently going into interchange actually counts for that Just skulking around the outside apparently does not Interesting. I, I've got like three survive and extract from interchanges done. Uh, I can't imagine that you'd need to go into the mall, but who am I to say? Right, that's handed in, so at least I'm not going to forget. Hey, kill killer 50 times, no thanks. <sighs> it's like may maybe once, just so I can say I've done it again. <laughs> Uh, right. Do I do I drink a drink? Uh... 
My dogs went to interchange to pick up your stuff. What did I take that I left behind? The gun? A gun? Oh yeah, the Toz. <laughs> I'm gonna get a shitty Toz back in insurance. Probably. If you don't, there's questions. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna go to my hideout quickly. That tickles me. That tickles me something chronic. That that Goshan fight was was fun. Uh, yeah, I found it really hard to see it like this. I think because of your angle and not having the scope. Okay, so the very first thing I'm going to do is drink, which is going to sort out my hydration, so that's all fine. Uh, all right, let's just remind myself of any other interchange tasks that I've got. So decontamination, got 6 out of 40 done. That's such a, such a slog. Uh, need one more book, four more survives, and that's it for there, other than peacekeeping mission, of course, and other things that might exist on many places. Okay, I think that's just about set up to go again. Just need to shuffle a few things around to get rid of this duffel. Which I don't care about. I'm going to have a look at my skills and see what I got on that last one. 0.42 metabolism. Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, so 1.48 metabolism. I got 0.42, apparently, so not much. Which I find uh, surprising. No, no. What mine is showing is what I have just got for ah. drinking now since I got back. Right. So, yeah, you check in raid, and if you don't check when you get back, you don't see. I guess so. Okay, so I think I'm good to go back to interchange again. Me too. Let me just check the uh, turn-ins. Oh shit, so many attack two backpacks. What the hell am I going to do with <laughs> this, man? Attack the block. I mean, it's, it's just not helpful. I don't like them. Right, let's take those six out. One, two, three, four, five, six, and I will sell these. 47 euros, please. And Peacekeeper also wants to give me an SR25, which is like, thanks, maybe, at some point. Oh, I've almost got too much money for my money case. <laughs> oh, woe is me. I'm so rich, I'm running out of places to put my ill-gotten well, money. I started tonight at 11 mil, and I'm at 13.2. Fine, <laughs> uh, let's, let's, let's just go back to interchange, I guess. Uh, I, I, feel, I really feel sorry for you. Especially when you were complaining about insuring my stuff. I wasn't. I was just like, wow, that's just, a lot. Just commenting. I got to keep my backpack. Yes. Yes, you did. Yeah, with that amount of spare money, if I was you, I would be bringing SPDs in as well. Uh, I mean, I really want another thick case, so I'm sort of saving up for that. I yeah. also want a few sick cases, so yeah. I'm saving up for those. Once, once I've got enough euros, I'm going to start investing in my next sick. Yeah, I have one at the moment, but Same. I would like one per map. Yeah, I, I'd, like, I'd like at least two more, of which probably one would be generic, and one would be for customs. Okay, so the other book uh, is sort of at that nook between Goshan and Idea. 
Uh, yeah, so go to Emacom and then it's a bit further along on the left, isn't it? Yeah. And then we need to get you into Mantis as well. So I would suggest we start with the book. The bookshop is quite an okay place to sit yeah. and wait for the raid to die down. Yeah, and you get to hear relatively it quiet. Around Mantis. Also, sitting in Emacom is fine, I suppose. Yeah, it just, just feels like if you're there, you're trapped. Well, because you are. Mm. It's, uh, it's got three ways in, three ways out, but... All locked. Walls everywhere. Yes. And at this point, everyone's got enough penetration to get through glass. Yes. I'm still really glad we got you another kill for your Punisher. Me too. Honestly, that's made my evening. <laughs> Here we go. I, I'm sad you died in that raid. Mm, I, I achieved my objective. You, you brought me yeah, the important the bits like, out, so I'm fine. I'm like, yeah, whatever. I got a new doll for my collection. I got a key tool. My gun came back. It's all good. So one of the things that um, uh, Nikita is entertaining for uh, 1.0 is private servers. Good. I mean, I'm okay with the PvP stuff, but I'm not sure I can get... In where cheating is so rampant in PvP stuff. Yeah. Okay, drinking. Straight in and under, or straight in and up to try and get up the stairs? Uh, in and up, I suppose. Or in and across to Emicom, maybe. Well, that's up to you. I would go to Idea at the back first. Yeah, sorry, uh, idea at the back and then, but we'd have to go through idea and then spin around the front to get to the stairs. Kind of. Like, in along this far wall of idea. Yeah, and, and then you have to go all the way to the very front before you can double back to get to the stairs. Oh yeah, yeah, it takes us to Emicom though. Yeah. Oh yeah. I don't need any of this by the way, so I'm... You need Emicom, don't you? Nope, did that. Oh. I've, I've done chemicals here. I need chemicals shoreline. Ah, right, okay. I think in at the front of idea is one of the really fast ways of getting in. So if you want to go to the book shop rather than Emicom, yep. that's fine first. Oh god, getting shot from behind. Yeah, I got him, I got him, I got him. Well done. I heard him at the last second. I think he was just solo. Okay, I'm pushing onto I'm the bookshop. You, he you heal up. So it's on a shelf in here, from what I remember. Got book P2. Got him. Oh, 
I hear a scav nearby. He might be angry at me from... I do it. Oh no, he's between us. Alright. He might be upstairs. Maybe. Looking for him. I don't see him down here. Right, I'm going to go in an Amicom. Oh, there he is on the corner. Got him. Oh. Right, I've left this guy's armour, mostly. I'm coming over to you. I need to pack a map. Actually, I'm going to lie down in this... Um, Right, I've got this this thing. Let's go in the bookstore. Okay, running over to the bookstore. I'm gonna lie down here. Yep. Your bag is too big. Do you want a stun grenade? Nah, I'm fine. Here, footsteps. Might be upstairs. Yeah, I think it is. No, down the end of the corridor. Did not get him. Running towards idea. Dying horribly. I suggest we go out the back. Do you have this book? Yeah, I do. Okay. I didn't finish packing my but that's alright. That's alright, we can we can secure over over here and do it. Yeah, I could have uh... SR2M some more. Did you actually get hit by him? Uh, I did, but I healed. Oh. Mac drills up to level four. I didn't check if the if the vehicle was there at the power station while we were there. My skills are looking pretty cough, by the way. Nice. Okay, so if I reload, I lose. Uh, let's just drop in 20 spare bullets. I don't need those. Okay, I'm good. Okay, we're going to go through here. We're going to push through into Goshan and then back to the route to the power station that we went previously. Okay. Shame I didn't have my SVD. <laughs> yeah, it really is. I would not have killed him with my SVD. So, so where was he? Uh, he just ran up the uh, escalator from idea. Scab over to the right. Heard him. I'm ignoring him, but... Oh, I just rubber banded. That's awkward. So I'm going into the little side room now. Okay, I'll be with you in a second. I want to kill this guy. Yeah, of course. You know what? I looked for him. I can't find him. I'm coming over to you. <laughs> All right. I don't like when I can't yeah. find scabs. I'll let you get your stamina back. I 
I can understand if you want to do more, but I've got two finding raid no. No, no, this is quest good. items. Uh, great. I'd rather go down this ramp than down the other ramp, just because there'll be people that have pushed through idea, I think. Did you bring money this time? Probably. Just jumped over the thing. I'll run ahead and scout there. You have the option of the... That's someone there. This is going to be fun then. Are we engaging? Um... I don't want to... I don't want to lose my items. I'm tempted to say go back to Emicom. Is that alright? Alright. I'm in the back, but I'm coming back slowly. You start making your way back to Emicom. Yeah. Go to the hole in the fence, say it's Yeah, but then the I lose my backpack. I suppose I can always buy another. But I like this backpack. I'd rather lose my items than the backpack. Okay. Running out of this area. Okay. But he definitely would have heard me, and I'm not going to be on the correct side of the fence, so I'm going to go in and up. I'm covering you, by the way. Oh, there you are. Cool. So we're going in and up, yeah? Yeah. I see him in the doorway. Player? Player. He's got PMC helmet. Uh, no, sorry, uh, Peacekeeper. Untar helmet on. I, I'd even say not in and up, just uh, just keep moving along. Right, I'm out, out of stamina. Okay. Gonna hurry past this. You know the. Ah, uh, the yeah, fine. We'll go here. The backpack will come back. All right, let's drop the backpack here. It's the smart play. It is. Like, as much as I hate to suggest it. So, still need to get into Mantis, of course, but that's the second book done, which is huge. We both got some scab kills. I think I got, yeah, I just got one scab kill, and I got that there. Uh, I just got one scab. Oh, you got the guy at the end. Oh, no, oh, the, the, the yeah, yeah, the one that was... Uh, and apparently someone copper slugged me in the stomach. No idea who. Some scab? That the, I... the scab right at the start. Yeah, I guess he did hit. And I didn't show on my screen. Or I would have been healing all this time. I guess I'm just not very observant. <laughs> Oh, ah, oh, you have hit me with the strength of a child. Ah, oh, ah, oh, I am, I am bleeding. Oh, no, I'm not. Because I checked after the PMC shot. Maybe it did zero right. blunt damage. Or no, 0. No. 0.1. I, I, I got like 30 damage or something. Oh. Mm. Okay, so selling this guy's stuff. And leaving his dog tag out. Sorry, where, where did you say he was again? He'd just come up the ramp, had he? He had just come up the ramp in idea and was yeah. leaning around that corner. Right. He heard us running. Yeah. He knew exactly where we were. Yeah, because that, that was what I thought. Like, if we're going to encounter anyone, it's going to be at the front of idea. So, Ragman, tasks. Hand over that booklet. That gives no fuss needed. 
Reach level three loyalty with therapist. Complete that. And vitamins. That was the other thing. Turn that in. Man, buy this helmet back you just gave me. It's 104k on a helmet. I can't afford that right now. <laughs> Alright, I can afford it. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna risk 104k on a helmet, especially not one that damages my hearing. What, the Alton? Yeah. Yeah, I'm about to sell that off to him as well. Uh, right, let's get two more drinks. Oh good, I can actually fit those attack two backpacks so I can sell them. <laughs> They're like 54k each. Yeah. I've got uh, two, no, I've got three Blackjack 50s. Uh, and the, oh my god, giant camping backpack. Put that in there, that's a bit better for space management. And then I've got a bajillion smaller backpacks for good measure. We both need what three kills each? No, four ki four kills each. Yeah, we've got uh, uh, five kills because we got. Five oh no, uh, four. 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 Yeah, yeah, we got seven in close range and one at long range is what I did. But yeah, assuming we can we can get these um, these kills, this has been really good. Completing like two entire. Maps of peacekeeping. Plus some other Plus quests along the incidentals, way. yeah. You know, it's. <laughs> yeah. I, I was going to say, it's, it's really nice that the only, like, legitimate suspicious thing was, like, obvious suspicion. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, that, uh, that guy. I heard one clang, and that was it. That was enough for me to turn around and take aim at where he was going to come round. And he was still round that corner and hurling bullets before I even saw him. Yeah. So there is still, like, not great uh, synchronization across the server. Guess I'm just lucky that he missed me and sort of hit you. Yeah, I mean, I think he was just aiming at me, and, you yeah, know, you've got to pick one person to shoot at, and he picked the person who... Um, who wasn't firing back, which was a mistake. <laughs> yeah, he probably saw you moving and didn't clock me as much. Yeah. Very fun evening so far, though. Yes.
a loading loot. Oh, mine's a waiting session start. Creating loot pools. Synchronizing with other players. You bringing an SVDS this time? <laughs> no. So what level was? I to go with one main focus. Yeah. And... No, I understand. Uh, Thirty-eight, he was. Okay. -ish. Yeah, so about the same as 30s. us. Yeah. Yeah. This feels like it's been reworked slightly. Just slightly. This is one of my fun sniping points, is being in the back of this van, by the way. Used to be. Can, can you still get in here? Like this? Yes. Yeah. Because, you know, the airdrop drops that specific spot. Yeah. Oh, so you just, like, go here and then just, like, ha-ha, fana fana. Yeah, basically. Nice. Uh, right, if we're going in to try and get Mantis, maybe in through the front? Yeah, I kind of think in through the front, but along via scav camp yeah. to account for people shooting us in the back. Oh, a raven! Fuck yes, I need that to get out. Okay, so change of plan, let's get you out. Uh, Emicom? Uh, uh, hole, hole in the wall, x -fill. Uh, Emicom is closer, along the back. Oh, I suppose, yeah, all right. Because that's my last, uh, living part yeah. of life is not a crime. Yeah. I might not come out with you, I might turn around and go back and, like, try and get... ...my thing. Yes. But getting... No, no, that, that, that's completely fine. Getting you to uh, x -fill at this point is, uh is important. We should go a little slower though. Yeah. So it doesn't count as a run through. Yeah, basically. We can also stick our head in here to the left and do minor bits of looting. Do you want to search my bag? I can put stuff in. <laughs> let's let's just pop our head in here and, and do it this way. There's a thing for you here. Oh, did not give me any XP. What? Ammo boxes. Psha. Alright, hold on. Those did. Uh, right. Those M scissors that I picked up. Right, so this goes in there and this and this. I'm not sure this actually gives me search XP. No, it doesn't. Because they're not finding can you Can you pick them up? Does it count? No, it does not. Okay. Well. Appreciate the effort, though. And if you wanted to waste time here, we could do some mag drills and then move on. Just like unload a couple of bullets, load them back in. No, I'm happy for us to go out back and all the way along. Okay. Like, if we don't sprint all the way there, yeah. we'll be fine time wise. How are we doing drinks wise? 100 seconds for maximum efficiency. So I'll wait a moment. Lua behind me has just started snoring and I thought it was some weird sound in Tarkov. Like bullfrogs or something. I don't know, it, it just, it sounded a bit like a car engine. Okay, I think we move closer to the road and try and get down in the depot load. 
Oh, there's no defilade anymore. Well, there goes that plan. Maybe over the other side. I mean, this is okay, to be honest. Yeah, I'm just worried about people coming from underneath. Yeah, this is a defilade over here. My next one. I'm going higher than you, by the way. Yeah. There's sometimes a stash over here. Yeah, there's oh, there's like two stashes over there. There's a, a little bag over here. Like Sorry. duffel bag. It's got ooh fuel can. Well, maybe I'll get out with you actually. I could hear a scav. There's no stash over here, at least not in the places that I know. Oh god! I just got shot. Is it just a scab? I don't know. The I've, had, over there, I've so. had to dive down. Uh, oh, yeah. Right. Well, I think that's at me, but it sounds like scabs. Yeah, I think it's the kind of scab that sees all. I'm going to run for a different... Don't, don't get yourself killed. I'm just medding up and then I'm going to... So they're definitely aimed at me at the moment. I'm in a different defilade. Yeah, I hear. I'm in and under. So I can come through under and get them from this side. I'm looking to see if I can see. I don't see them. Oh, there he is. Right, you bastard. Got him. There's another scab under here that's running. Yeah. I'm now against the little wall underneath where um, where you come out on top. Okay, got one. I've got one over here. I can hear another There's still. In here, yeah. I can see his feet. I'm gonna leave him for a moment. It, whereabouts is he? Is he out in the yard? He's the uh, slope going up to Goshan. Okay. I'll try and get him from over this side. There's one by the bus. Hit him a little. Might have got him, don't know. This but, guy is still choking to death. I'll get him in a second. I'm just packing bullets. Yeah, I'm just worried that the longer we take, the more chance of a player coming along and uh, killing you. That's fair. I can hear him coming at me now. I'm walking next to the ramp that uh, leads down. There he is. Right, got one at the main entrance. Okay. I'm going to go round and try and get the... I'm getting the guy. I have killed the one by the bus. That's good. I can see him uh, very dead. 
God, he's still alive. Sh oh, there's two of them. Woo! Whereabouts are they? Coming over to me under the uh, ram. Killed one. Yeah, that's that's probably him. I oh, know there's another. I see him. Got him. Oh. Sorry. No, no, no. It's all good. Coming at, I'm coming out to you. Okay, I'm back on the outside of this wall. Hi. Hi. So I've done peacekeeping mission now. I have not. I am going for Excel. Yeah, you do that. I'm just taking what I can from this guy. I see you legging it. <laughs> Third drink. Uh, I just uh, drank um, something else, so I'm going to save my right. third. Okay, I'm out. Doesn't matter. I'm, I'm going to yeah, save my third drink for another time. Extracting four, three, two, one. That was a bit intense. Yeah. So I got one out of those guys and oh, you got the rest of them. I'm sorry. But I, That's okay. I was really worried that you were going to round a corner and just have that beaming scav that I had initially. Yeah. What? <laughs> I can definitely sympathise with that. So. Yeah, so I got five, four of them headshots. All of, oh, One of them was a bit too far away, that very final one. Yeah, it was so weird. Like, I would shoot one, he would duck around a corner, and then he would be two. <laughs> Repeat that a couple of times. Yes. It's just like a Hydra. <laughs> well, on the plus side, that means I don't need to kill any more scavs. So they're pretty much going to be all yours. You can hand that in. And, uh, I, I am doing so right now. <laughs> very, very pleased with that. Mm, I do still need scavs for decon, but obviously that's not as important as your peacekeeping mission. I am glad you recognise that. Okay, so got just a couple of things to get rid of. Let me sort out this as well, some fresh ammo. I only used eight ammo. Again, I use quite a lot because putting <laughs> lots of bullets in things and then you taking the kills. Uh, which is fine, by the way. <laughs> it's incredibly amusing is what it is. Uh, and at the end, I found a wallet with 5,000 rubles in it. Yay, if you can. And lots of fuel can. Put that somewhere obvious so I don't forget about it. Got another grenade on that as well. Right, what am I selling these for? Okay. That's a new six. Not really. Oh, I'll just go to trash a lot of that. Damage my untar armor, but not enough to warrant me uh, replacing it. Ah, oh, Kevin, I'm glad you you've been enjoying it this evening. It's been very fun for me. As you say, some uh, some tense times and some uh, 
some good progress. Okay, I'm good to go again. Okay, I'm just going to do a teeny bit of uh, logistics just to take that water oh, out. He wants to give me another fucking Alton. <laughs> just sell it. Just be like, yeah, I'll take it. Anyone want to buy an Alton? He also wants to give me a CPC, which is quite nice. So. I will probably just sell it. I don't know. It is really nice. I love the CPC on one. Alright, I will hold off. Like a day because I can't do it while that's, that's my yeah. Strategy. I'm very nearly done. I've just got like one more teeny thing to do. So cool. I've just not been bothering with my uh, logistics of um, the hideout this evening. Yeah, it's just just because my um, my water filter was ready to go, so I was like, fine, I'll do that. Okay, and that's it. That's all I needed. So, you don't need anything now, really, except decon by accident. Uh, correct. And... Uh, oh, uh, going into Mantis, but that's me. Me oh, yes. being... Me. That's fine. Like, because it doesn't matter if I die even... Uh, I mean... If I get the kills that I want, it doesn't yeah. matter if I die. Yeah, we, we, we get you peacekeeping mission, and after that, if we're in the mood, we go into Mantis. Oh, we definitely go to Mantis. 100%. So, what was it we said out. last time? In through the front? <laughs> and then you find oh, a raven. <laughs> <laughs> like, immediately. <laughs> I was like, ooh, change plans. I mean, that would only have been a more change of plans if it had been a 3BTGC yeah. sample stim. <coughs> Excuse me. I think there should be more stuff like peacekeeping mission that is dailies. Yeah, I mean, do, doing stuff, it, it does have some things like that, like um, kill blah 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 with X series weapon, but it's normally bosses. And it's not normally themed, right? Yeah. Because they've got the Korakulan, they've got that um, weird new helmet, so they could have kill scabs while dressed as the Chinese military. Yeah. Um, and, and other related things. Yeah, kill scams while wearing a red armband and blah 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 outfit. Red cap. Um... Doctor disrespect armor. Kill scams while using a revolver and wearing a cowboy hat. Kill scams while using the blinky. What? Oh. I was going to say, what's that? But the I remember what it is. I you have one. Kill things with it. Yes, you can. It does one damage. Yeah, and the magazine holds twenty. So, yes, which is not enough to kill someone. So you would need to reload. Sure. Or have them already be damaged. Okay, it is easier to kill someone with a flare than it yep. is to kill someone with a blinky. One hundred percent true. I'm honestly surprised it's not a Jaeger task to kill Killer with a Blinky. I mean, his tasks are hard, but they're not that hard. I know. Uh, therapist one, uh, ambulances again, is perhaps the hardest task, I think, in the game. Ambulances again? What's that one? Okay, so on streets, there are eight ambulances. Mm-hmm. In one of them is a phone. Get the phone, use the vehicle car extract with the phone in your possession. So the vehicle has to be there and not yes. be taken by the time you find the phone. Yes. 
Wow. And the phone has to be in, like, there's eight ambulances. They're all over the place. And it's not just in the footwell of one of the ambulances. No, each ambulance has different places that it could be, <laughs> including not in the ambulance. That's a little funny. And also terrible. Like, the so advice that I've read around the task, because I have the task, and I was like, this <coughs> seems like a really interesting task. Cap uh, the vehicle extract until with... PMCs are all dead, and then go looking? No, no, no. Find where it is, and apparently that's where it's locked in for you. Oh. So you actually right. pick it up. The vehicle is there. I forgot my spare drinks, because I'm an idiot, but that's fine. I've got one drink, which is, which is fine. Same route. Same route. Uh, vehicle is there, by the way, if you didn't hear. Yeah, I did. Thank you for confirming. So, same route. We're just going further this time. Same. Mm hmm. Except that was more over Goshan direction, I think. Yeah. Perhaps even Ollie. already right in the center possibly front of the store yeah as in front of the big mall yeah killer could be what am i zeroed in right let's unzoom that a little okay. oh god getting shot at from behind So I'm going to round this corner. I don't see the scav. I'm going to go for Mantis. Okay. Oh my god, that sounds so bad. There's flashes. Don't oh no! So many flashes and grenades. I'm dead. That is a massive Player? grenade spam. Player, I presume. Uh, I believe so. I'm not yet at the death screen. I don't think it would have been a scav. Yeah, it was a player. Okay, I'm gonna go for these. Um... Scavs, and then see if I can do anything. They're a level 59. So I would uh, I would keep away from them. <laughs> They've been on 1,412 raids. <laughs> he might already be dead, actually. Why do you think that? Because his profile has him just carrying a red rebel. Oh no, he sniped me. He must have been at the very bottom of the... Um, the sorry, the very top of the ramp from the uh, car park. Oh well. Yeah, I would keep well clear of my body.
even if he is dead, that whole area is just like danger, danger. I might go back there once I've uh, done scabs. I'm going to do a quick factory scav run and then maybe take the uh, the stuff in to interchange. Do I care about this stuff ending up being found in raid? No, that's just extract. Okay, peacekeeping mission is done. Well done. Mm. So anything else is just decon for you. Uh, you may as well get into a scav run if you haven't already. I've just finished a scav run, so I'm going to hop into a PMC run on interchange with my scav stuff. Just to see if I can sure. blitz it. I'm getting a few scav kills, which is quite nice. Yeah, progress on decon, bit of XP. It's all good. So, yeah. Yeah, you know what? Let's take a red flare, pop that outside. Try and encourage anyone to go that way. Probably not a sensible gun to take in for this, actually. Let's swap it over for the one I got previously. Sure, that'll do. King of bad ideas. I'm now yeah. going towards the centre of the... Uh map to where your body was. Oh, brave. Oh, 
Right, I'm going for a nighttime interchange run, and I've got a flare. Sure. So I'm gonna. Running around like a scav. Definitely a player. People don't run around like this. Killer does. Enough and walking away slowly. Now I'm heading towards your body. From the Emicom side, I was at the first door to Mantis. has been quiet there for a while now. So if you got grenades Scabs remote. They are AI scabs of some sort. So I'm guessing that's killer's goons or something. Killer doesn't really have goons, but yeah. Hey there, Technical Raven. Not sure if you're still watching. Apologies, I missed your chat before. I had uh, one of the maps up and it was uh, it was obscuring the view. Um, for, uh, for teaming up, I only play with my brother, uh, unfortunately, uh, with very, very few exceptions to that. Monday night is family night.
Although I suspect your message was right at the very beginning of the evening, because that's when I covered that window. Hurrah. Kevin, cheers for coming along, mate. Hope you've enjoyed. Have a very good week. Hey, I'm finally getting into a raid. I've killed like 12 scabs now. It was very mental. It could have been someone tagged and cursed and then someone else like picking them all off. I'm gonna have to take your gun to use your bullets. Sure. There's two 60 round mags, remember? One in the gun, one in the rig. Someone's taking your gun. There's an RPK 16 on yours, so that's definitely from Killer. Yeah. That's just rude. Look around all the scabs in the area. Just in case it was a scav. Yeah. I'm still fighting scabs and stuff. Uh, don't forget there's ammo on my rig. Uh, I checked. There is not. Okay. So in that case, it was probably taken by an actual player. front of the store. <laughs> Scav shooting me in the back. Oh god, and in the front. Book it for the vehicle extract. You know what? I'm leaving. <laughs> Somehow I'm leaving. Oh, my God. 
I looked everywhere, I couldn't find your guns. No problem. Actually, that's a really good idea. Don't worry. Impressive. Uh, and most of them, all of them, uh, were less than 60 meters. Really well done. I'm just about to make it to the backpack extract. I am coughing and spluttering because my stomach is buggered. I am bleeding again, but I am extracting. And I still have my flare. Oh, the risky paid off. <laughs> that that was the, the jankiest Blitz raid. I ran straight up the main stairs inside. There were two scabs at the top, ran straight past them. One of them hit me in the arm, the other hit me in the back. Oh gosh. Ran inside Mantis, came back out after a bit of medding, killed them both. By then my stomach was gone. Uh, but I have made it out. So I got shot with 760x39HP and 760x39PS. <laughs> Nasty. Yikes. Right. Yeah. Uh, let's just heal the light bleed. Uh, so we, we can do a scav run to finish off. I reckon I just need to reorganise things a little bit so there's space to dump at the end of it. Sure. Oh, and I need to hand that in <laughs> just as soon as I get back to the menu. Right. Trading. Skier. Tasks. Turn in. There we go. Really happy with that. Very nice. I had nine bullets left at the end as well. <laughs> just for, you know, good, good measure. I don't know how I'm doing on decon. Let's have a quick look. I am at 28 out of 40. I am 70% of the way there. It's going going well then. So that is quite nice. Uh, let's put that in my inventory. I can sell that. To Jaeger. And very quickly I'll just check see if I can fit more fuel in the hideout. I suspect I can't, but Generator, no, no space in that. That's fine. So what I'll do is I'll put that in that scab box. Loads of space in other other places for other things. Uh, let's put the bandages up in here. Cool. 
Good to go. Is your scav valuable? Don't know. Let me find out. Back. Overall. Scav. No. No. My scav is a, is a ultra cheap ass. 179k. Yeah, mine's 200. So probably just a slightly fancier scope or headset. <laughs> I find it very interesting that they've actually got round to removing the memory skill and updating the descriptions on how you level things. Even if they're not entirely accurate, they're mostly there. Yeah. The, uh, the prestige system in 1.0 uh, will get you unique items. Uh, and it's in like unique drip or I don't know precisely uh, so in the recent interview Nikita uh, said unique items which to me implies like guns equipment maybe an armband yeah hopefully it's something shit like armbands yeah Cause... or like an unlimited number of berets or something like that yeah, yeah so some unlockable that's equivalent to something else but just looks slightly different Novelty rig. A belt feeder for the blinky. Well, I'm in. We're in Concordia somewhere, or at least I am. Cool. I'm at 91% loading loot, so it won't be long. I'd be tempted to go to the um, car warehouse in the centre and uh, see if there's any dead PMCs around Kolotny. <laughs> Almost in the waiting session start. Okay, I am in and I'm in a Concordia building. I heard a scab going map and there. Yeah, that's me. Hello. Hello. So we could check downstairs or we could just yeah, uh, let's let's do what you suggested, sure. Is that a dead body? No, it's been back. It looked like a scab. <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> what have I actually got in this buckshot? In the the proper way. Dodging the mines rather than uh, trying to wiggle my way between buildings and stuff. I can't hear you running. You are silent to me. Yeah, you are making no sound at all. Love it. Now I can hear you. There's a backpack here. It's got whiskey. Uh there is a scav wielding PMC stuff. It's got a cat. Someone's clearly been very efficient. I'd be oh my god, this has got like high lots of high value stuff in.
Yeah, Oh, you okay? Possibly at me. I think the scabs don't like me being in Oh, yeah, there. yeah, and they're shooting me as well, so I'm leaving. So you're going to die unless you get out of there. Well, they're not shooting me at the moment, so maybe they just hated you? No. I'm pretty certain it, they'll also hate you just for being near for too long. You know what, just in case, I'm going to go far away. Yeah, you go far away. They're still not shooting me. They just killed another rando scab. Maybe it's because I took the backpack and that's like their loot. That could be new behaviour. Well, I'm going to get out of the ventilation shaft because I got me a cat. <laughs> oh, I, think I think they are angry at me. Like, I can hear them aiming at me through walls. I'm extracting. Not the most interesting raid, but I got another cat. <laughs> yep, no, they, they ultra murdered me as soon as I moved. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been so dead in my life. I actually managed to round the corner, but then straight into two other goons that just opened up. Yeah. Once the boss is angry at you, the guards will get angry at you. The guards can get angry at you separately. When the guards get angry at you, all scabs nearby get angry at you. Great, so it's like a horrible, vicious circle of anger. Yeah. So, who actually got... Oh, Caban actually killed me. On the plus side, did exactly what I wanted. <laughs> Went along, got some loot from someone who died nearby. Nice. making your way back over to a manhole. Uh, no, I got out through the ventilation shaft. Oh, nice. Well done. Yeah, so I'm I'm just back at, uh, at the menu now. Uh, and with that, I think I'm probably going to finish up there for the evening. So. Um, right, so thank you very much for coming along, everyone. I do hope you have enjoyed this. So we've finished off customs. Uh, for peacekeeping mission. We also got Greg the Mark Dream on customs, so that's two big wins there. Another kill for uh, for his um, uh, Punisher quest line. We've done interchange. We've both got the uh, the books, both done peacekeeping mission, and I've got the um, the chemicals on there as well for the vitamins quest line. Uh, so uh, even more huge wins, and only two deaths across the course of the evening, and one of them was very 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 sus. Uh, I'd say that's a huge success. As always, if you have enjoyed this, be sure to give a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and do so and to be told when we go live in the future. Otherwise, have a very good week and see you again soon. And, uh,